In this video, I will discuss about writing and testing a small program into case software. You double click on the key icon, it will open this window. So, for creating a new project, uh, go to the project icon, then new microvision project. It will ask for the saving a file. So, uh, I am creating the folder on the desktop. Uh, actually, Microvision project, uh, uh, this software, software creates many files, so we need to create a specific folder so that all files contain in the same folder. So I am I'm creating a folder from test, and then in the test, I will create the project by uh, any other name, so I am creating it by the test name itself. And then save. Uh, it will ask for, for the target hardware, like for which microcontroller we are trying to write the code. Like uh, if we are uh, writing for Atmel processor 89C51, so we will select on here Atmel, then 89C51, and then OK. So our project has been created. Now we will uh, write a program. So for writing a program, we need to open a script. So either you can go from this icon or from the file, and then new. Uh, we have two options for writing the programs in KL. Like we can write in assembly language or we can write in C language. So in this video, I will discuss about only the assembly language case. So first, we need to save this file uh, into the so that it can understand the ASM code. So after selecting, after creating this uh, script, then save it in the same name and then by any name like Sachin dot ASM. This AFM should be uh, there to uh, let the software know that it is an assembly file and then save it. Now we will write a new program like ORB00H and then move accumulator S33H and then and 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 the next step comes for uh, mm, uh, compiling or assembling the script. So for assembling, first we need to add this file into our project. So for adding to this file, go to project and then manage and then components and environment. In this components environment, we go to the add file step. In the add file step, right now it is displaying only on the C source file. So our file was assembly coded, so we will select from here the ASM source file. Now the ASM source file has been displayed. We will select this session file and then add and then close it. So our file has been added here and then OK. So for verifying it, our file will be displayed in this loop dot ASM name. And then we will uh, set the uh, options for target one like we want to generate a hex file out of it so in the options of the target and select output tab and click on this file create hex file and then ok now we are ready to compile it go into the project and build target if everything will be built and there will be zero error and we generally ignore warning so our uh, hex file has been generated. Now we want to know how this code is running. So we'll go to the debug window and then start stop debugging session. So uh, we will run it step by step. So this is the uh, we will press this icon. It has executed that uh, single command and that means the move A has 33 X. And from here, this window, we can uh, check the content of the register. So the 33 uh, data has been moved to it. So in, in this video, we have learned how to use key and uh, how to debug the program. Uh, so that's it for this video. Thank you.